Ted and Timothy another happy birthday by the time it's over. Continue their little 
can't even hold it up. Now we're just not going to let him climb down. He's going to have to stay up there for a while. Well, hey, Bradley Starrett. It has been way too long since you've been here in Victory Lane. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, it has been a long time. I want to thank Chad Taylor for putting this on and putting me in a good car. This thing just drove itself around here. He, uh, he told me just to floor it, and that's what I did, and it just went around here. So uh, I guess, I, guess we, uh, I think I tore the front bumper off there. Sorry about that. Yeah, I think the wheel was <laughs> yeah, yeah uh, <laughs> I, my teammate was in the way. I had to move him. <laughs> So how much convincing did it take for you to participate in this race? None. I mean, none. We're, we're all racers over here. I don't, I don't care what it is. I'll race a lawnmower. Um, I think just about anybody over there is the same way. We're all racers. These guys put just as much time in these things as we do as the sprint cars, the modifieds. Um, so I have a lot of respect for these guys. You know, some of them got racing when they were later. They, you know, I got, I got into go-karts when I was younger and was able to kind of work my way up. And uh, I never, th this really wasn't around when I was, you know, coming up through the ranks. So I think this is a great starter class for, for younger kids. And I'd like to see them out here more. Um, to see all these guys, you know, they, they put a lot of effort into these things. Well, very, very well said. And plus that, you get to donate to charity. I mean, you get in the car and people are like, let's get Bradley Stewart some money to climb in a race car. You got to like that. Well, the money I won tonight is going in the, we're, we're giving that away. We're, the, the money I won, that's going to St. Jude. Uh, Chad, and I, Chad and I talked about that. Yeah. Uh, that's what this whole thing's about is, is the kids and uh, we talked about it and I told him if I won I wanted to give it give it uh, put it in the bucket there so but I want to thank him and uh, I, I don't know if he has any sponsors that he wants to thank or anything he's the one that put this whole deal on and uh, I really appreciate it him let me be a part of it and I'm hoping some other guys you know some bigger names uh, hop in these things next year because I had a lot of fun I mean I, I started I don't know where I started 10th or something and and uh, if anybody's wondering uh, this thing went 65 miles an hour down the straightaway I was looking at the speedometer <laughs> it still works Hell yeah it does but <laughs> the, the, uh, the, your check engine lights on though <laughs> We'll have to talk to Travis Kern about that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Chad, since you, I mean, you're here, you organize this. Do we have sponsors to thank, or do we just need to talk a little bit more about St. Jude? You know, I, I want to thank my sponsors on the car, first and foremost. Soggy Bottom Performance, uh, Luke Bland, I, I know he's still in the house. Not enough can be said about all Luke Bland has done for me, uh, just, just teaching me on these cars and what to do. Kirk Mullis at Value Fence, my crew at Quality Certified Transmission Specialist, Mark Moat at Moat Flooring Installation, uh, Iron Pit Restoration, uh, Lord, so many, so many, Travis Kern Racing Engines, there's so many I can't, I can't even begin. Larry Babs, uh, for all he does, I mean, my Lord, we had seven hours of sleep and three days getting these cars ready for this, so, uh, you know, we, uh, we had a heck of a show here tonight. Uh, there's, a, there's a team back here that when we get done talking to Bradley, I want to recognize these guys because these guys, they came out here tonight to put on a good show. Brian Gray that drove this 23 Minion car back here, this guy has driven everything that has wheels on it. And uh, they drove all the way up here from, from Kentucky to make this haul just to support this cause. You know, And if we could get a round of applause for these guys, these guys are racers that under... They've taken this passion for racing and turned it into something that we can all be proud of tonight. With that said, $500 more dollars to the purse. Mr. O'Leary and Hamilton Racing, uh, I believe we have another 500 to go with this. And if you guys will hang tight for just a little bit, we'll let you know our final total on what we raised tonight. Excellent. Thank you. So um, I've seen some preliminary totals, and it is a really impressive number. Bradley, we're not done with you. You've got, you've got, where's the bucket? Where's the, where are the, our... There, there, there. <laughs> I know. Like, see, don't we need yeah. to see him back? What do you think, fans? Bradley Starrett in a car racing here week by week. Can we can we make that happen? I'm, I've been running a little bit. I, I just, you know, we won the points last year, and that's what we set out to do. I just, uh, I'm a full-time fireman. That You know, I'm supposed to be at work tonight, and I uh, took off, and it just, yeah, no, I wasn't <laughs> sick. I don't do that. Uh, and I work for my parents uh, through the week, so, um, you know, my weekends I kind of cherish now, and I, I've done this for so long, and, um, I still want to race, but I want to. I want to keep it around ten or fifteen nights. You know, it, it it got to where it was kind of a job, and I wasn't having fun. And now, you know, Roddy's let me run.
run three or four races, and then uh, I drove Burton's car tonight. Uh, I wish I could have had a better performance there, but uh, hopefully they'll let me go again, and we can make some more adjustments that'll suit me a little bit better, and I can get that car up front. That would that would be awesome. That that uh, I, I think about that all the time. I really appreciate them letting me run their car, and um, man, that would be sweet to win in that thing. Suffice to say, we really, really miss you. But let's let's draw some numbers. You're going to have to stick your hand in the little pail here. One number here. This is One the number. Prize winner for the two seater ride along in Indianapolis. This is the two seater ride along in Indianapolis. So make it a good one. I mean, no pressure, no pressure. So what we've got? Seven six five. Five five nine seven six five 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 nine. You just won a two seater ride at Indianapolis. 187 mile an hour. I hear them. <laughs> so do we send them to the? Where do we send them? Actually, if they will uh, get with me, I will give them the contact. Information. Where are you going to be? I will be over here in my hauler after the race. Just come over and find it. Go to the Chad Taylor hauler after the race. That's where you need to go. So Chad Taylor's hauler. I think it's green. Look for the 85 car. You'll find him. He'll give you all the information you need. We're good? Okay. We're going to go back here. Okay. So now we're moving over here. So, Brian Gray, where did you come from in Kentucky? Well, we came, this is a car owner, uh, Justin Dalton. He come from all the way in Florence, Union, Kentucky, Independence, somewhere down in there. Um, and I'm from Hamilton, Ohio, which is on the other side of the state somewhere. So we came down to support St. Jude's and have fun racing with all these guys. This was a huge, huge event. Thank you all for coming out. Thanks for everybody that put money in my box down there because otherwise I was starting way in the back. We had no idea where we were going to start at, but uh, this was great. Thank you guys for putting on the show. We really appreciate you having us out here. Well, and it was an adventure, was it not? It was an adventure getting here, yep. and I could tell you a big story about that, but <laughs> let's just say the car arrived before we did. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, let me just say, we are glad that you were here. Thank you so much for all your effort to support this. Happy to see you here, and I think we have a job for you as well. We need you to reach your hand in that bucket, and you are... You are selecting the person who is going to win some kind of super amazing oil change thing, and that is 757405. Again, 757405. You're going to go to Chad Taylor's hauler after the races, okay? 757405. You won the oil change and lube job. Thank you so much for coming. Good to see you. Yes. All right.